want to make mining as, as simple as possible to get the tons out and safe as possible. It is, you know, 9,600 feet deep. It's the deepest base metal mine in the world. So it takes an hour to travel from surface to your workplace. The auto mine light system uh, here on site, we have four robots that basically work in an underground capacity. Uh, we control them from surface. Our workforce can only be underground for so long. Our usual shifts were about uh, 10 hours and we were losing about three hours of that per shift where men were having to travel underground. We bought the system to take that out of the equation and to increase our productivity based on having somebody in a chair either full time or in between those shifts when nobody was going to be mucking underground. They're much higher utilized because we don't need to stop for blasting. You know, they can keep running while men are going up and down the shaft. And right now we have four. We just ordered another one, so we'll have actually five more. Ones. The impact on, on safety, especially at KID, which is, is a seismic mine, so when we blast we have seismic events, is we can, we can muck without the guy being there. So from a productivity point of view, that's a huge benefit. The Sandvik Auto Mine System has met all of our needs. We're taking it one step further and we're working with Sandvik and they've worked diligently with us to move this particular system one step forward. Each chair is operated by one operator. We could eventually move into where one chair operates two pieces of equipment. They've worked with us in the background very diligently to progress this forward.